Can you guess what that uh, banana trail is for? Yes. Secrets. Well, that was rude. Oh ho ho! I kind of forgot to use the uh, the D-pad input there. That was awkward. Okay, that'll work, that'll work. Wait, so where did I miss the K? Rats. Yeah, I'm just passing secrets left and right, honestly. This is a pretty shameful playthrough. Well, rats. Get me out. Treetop Town. You might have seen that uh, is very visible, this bonus game. Bonus barrel, I should say. Let's try that again. I believe it's either this level or something similar. <laughs> to a uh, level like this. Oh, that was so cheap. That uh, you actually have to watch. Be a little bit careful in the sense that, because these ones are auto fires, right? The ones that don't have that symbol, you can choose when to go. So there's this thing though, where you have to, before you get into the auto, like here, see, you have to wait till it lines up. <laughs> Lest get shot to your doom. Here too, so. Oh, I thought I, I thought that was lined up. What in the world, man? That is so sad. Ho ho ho! Can you believe that? We did it. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Is this a, oh man. What is this garbage? Right, here's a safe one. Okay. Oh! That's it. I want to quit this game. Let's go back to Yoshi's Island, where basically <laughs> you can just keep getting stars and your stars regenerate, and it's so peaceful. Oh no, you missed it again. <sighs> Saved it.
only to give it all away. All right, let me get a countdown. Five more lives to go before mass destruction. Similar to Yoshi's Island, the physics and controls are very fluid, very smooth. What the crap? I was like trying to... I was trying to go back and it just like took me down. Well hey, the good news is, like, since I'm gonna game over and kinda lose most of my progress anyways, I can just like delete this video in existence and pretend like it never happened. Okay, this is like the most unfair momentum I've ever seen though. Oh ho ho ho! I fought against that with every tooth and nail. <sighs> Heart attack. Somebody is gonna run home to mama and get some lives right quick. <laughs> uh, meanwhile, poor Funky is like, hey man, if you see Candy, tell her I'll give her surfing lessons for free, man. At least Candy is dressed modestly, right? She's in a one-piece swimsuit as a, a fraction, and also, oops. What do you think was gonna happen, Jerry? What movie's that on? Why can't he get up on here? Thank you. No, we want, we need, we need lives and bonuses. Man, I am like totally off rhythm, because basically all of these ropes are supposed to, like if you're playing it good and have a good rhythm, it all lines up. You don't have to sit there and wait through a cycle every single time. I like how Diddy like warps to where the the uh, rope is supposed to be. Oh boy! Aha! I'm pretty sure one of these. It might actually be this wall right here. You're supposed to save that barrel for this one, I think. Another uh, secret, I believe. Oh man, it's just that. A lot of good that's gonna do me. Always follow the arrows to your death! Psych.
two in one level. There was no secret in that, or I didn't, or you need donkey. I don't know. I don't remember. Well, a swing and a miss. You're supposed to hit the tire. Well, we were, we were making a good run there, getting in rhythm, then we so died. You kind of don't know you're getting... Oh, man. Just despawn, will ya? Just let me... Just let me play this level in peace. Ah, we're right there. However, even though the mechanic is programmed into Donkey Kong Country games, it's extremely rare for there to be that many sprites on screen. And in fact, I think there's only one part in this entire Donkey Kong Country 1 game where there is enough, I think it's like a string of beavers. Aha! And sure enough, if you land on all of them, you'll get the, uh, can Diddy? Kind of my style. You get a, a one-up. Okay, I love this level because notice how it started out kind of like daytime, and as we progress further, like the gradient changes to like this beautiful sunset color. So nice. Hopefully that gives some nice ideas for some ROM hacks out there. Super Mario World ROM hacks. Or any ROM hack for that matter. Alright, so this is, I forget its name. His legs are so long he can just walk over some enemies. And you can kind of fly. It's like gliding down though, you can't gain height. It's trapped. Well, might as well exit with you. Clam City isn't that bad of game. The the water level I detest the most in this game is actually the What's it called? Poison Pond? Or whatever. Because it's kind of... There are some sections in it that aren't exactly fair. Oh boy. Fish. So wait, where was the K? somewhere close here.
Whew, get me out. Bumblebee Rumble. So basically you just hit this thing, make it mad, then it goes on a tantrum, so you just dodge it while it's in its tantrum phase. Then it calms down and it's like, eh, you know, you're not so bad. Then rinse and repeat until you've beat the snot out of this wasp hornet Oh! Leave his world for the ice.